social media is deeply ingrained in our lives, especially for young people. Schools are taking a stand against tech giants. Meta, Google, TikTok and Snap face lawsuits over a student mental health crisis. Lawsuits claim these platforms are addictive, prioritizing profit over well-being. Schools witness the impact of excessive social media use firsthand. Concerns about declining mental health, anxiety and depression are rising. The outcome could change how social media platforms operate and are regulated. U.S. District Judge Yvonne Gonzalez Rogers ruled that Meta, Google, TikTok and Snap must face the lawsuits brought against them. This decision, made in Oakland, California, prevents the tech giants from dismissing the claims. It contradicts an earlier decision by a Los Angeles court. This highlights the complexity of regulating social media companies. The cases represent a major step towards holding these companies responsible. Judge Rogers' decision signifies a growing willingness to hold social media companies accountable. This could empower other school districts to take legal action. The tech industry is closely watching these developments. This ruling marks a turning point in addressing the impact of social media on young people's mental health. At the heart of these lawsuits are the experiences of students and educators. Schools are witnessing a decline in students' mental and physical health due to excessive social media use. The pressure to stay connected leads to sleep deprivation. The classroom is also feeling the impact. Academic performance and engagement are declining. Social media contributes to comparison and cyberbullying. Schools are left to deal with the fallout. Educators demand tech companies take responsibility. The claims made by school districts are not unfounded. A growing body of research supports the link between excessive social media use and negative mental health outcomes, particularly among young people. Studies have found a correlation between increased social media use and higher rates of anxiety, depression, body image issues, and suicidal thoughts. Neuroscience is also providing insights into how social media affects the developing brain. The constant stream of notifications and rewards triggers the release of dopamine, a neurotransmitter associated with pleasure and addiction. This can create a cycle of dependence making it difficult for young people to disengage from these platforms. Furthermore, social media can disrupt sleep patterns, which are crucial for physical and mental health. The blue light emitted from screens interferes with melatonin production, a hormone that regulates sleep. The scientific evidence is clear excessive social media use can have serious consequences for young people's mental and physical well-being. These findings underscore the urgency of addressing this issue and the need for greater responsibility from tech companies. The research is clear. Excessive social media use is linked to a range of mental health issues from anxiety and depression to sleep disturbances. It's crucial that we take these findings seriously and work towards solutions that protect our young people. Beyond the classroom, the impact of social media addiction extends far beyond the classroom. It has significant societal costs that we are only beginning to understand. As young people spend increasing amounts of time online, they may be missing out on essential social interactions and real-world experiences critical for developing social skills and emotional intelligence. Excessive social media use can also contribute to a decline in civic engagement. Instead of engaging in their communities and participating in meaningful dialogue, young people may become increasingly isolated and apathetic. This can have long-term consequences for democracy and social cohesion. Moreover, the constant exposure to curated content and online personas 
can distort perceptions of reality, leading to unrealistic expectations and dissatisfaction with one's life. This can fuel a culture of comparison and contribute to feelings of inadequacy and anxiety. Addressing the issue of social media addiction is not just about protecting young people, it's about safeguarding the future of our society. We must recognize the broader implications of this issue and work together to create a healthier digital environment. Balten. A call to action. Examining our own digital habits. The lawsuits against social media giants serve as a wake-up call for all of us. While the legal battle plays out, it's an opportune time to reflect on our own relationships with social media. Are we using these platforms consciously and intentionally, or are we allowing them to dictate our time and attention? Take a moment to consider how much time you spend on social media each day. Are you using it to connect with others in meaningful ways, or are you mindlessly scrolling through your feeds? Are you feeling pressured to present a perfect online persona, or are you comfortable sharing your authentic self? This is not about demonizing social media, but about using it responsibly and mindfully. By becoming more aware of our digital habits, we can take control of our online experiences and minimize the potential negative impacts. Taking control strategies for healthy social media use. Creating a healthier relationship with social media starts with awareness and intentional action. Here are some strategies to consider. Use the built-in features on your phone or download apps to track and limit your social media use. Designate specific times throughout the day to disconnect from social media and engage in other activities. Unfollow accounts that make you feel inadequate or trigger negative emotions. Follow accounts that inspire you, provide valuable information or make you laugh. Make an effort to connect with people face to face. Schedule coffee dates, join a club or volunteer in your community. Pay attention to how you feel before, during and after using social media. If you're feeling anxious, stressed or envious, it might be time to take a break. Remember you are in control of your social media use. By implementing these strategies you can create a healthier and more fulfilling online experience. Hack Shaping the Future – The Role of Regulation and Responsibility The lawsuits against social media giants highlight the need for greater regulation and accountability in the tech industry. Governments and policymakers have a responsibility to protect citizens, especially young people, from the potential harms of technology. This includes implementing stricter privacy regulations, limiting targeted advertising to minors, and requiring social media companies to design platforms that prioritize user well-being over engagement metrics. Transparency is also crucial. Tech companies should be more transparent about their algorithms and the potential impact of their platforms on mental health. However, regulation alone is not enough. Tech companies must also take responsibility for the products they create. This includes investing in research to better understand the impact of their platforms, designing features that promote digital well-being, and providing resources and support to users who may be struggling with addiction or other negative consequences. Creating a safer and healthier digital environment requires a collaborative effort. Governments, tech companies, educators, parents, and individuals all have a role to play in shaping the future of technology. Join the conversation, share your thoughts and experiences. The impact of social media is a complex and evolving issue that requires ongoing dialogue and action. We invite you to share your thoughts and experiences in the comments section below. How has social media impacted your life or the lives of young people you know? 
What steps can we take individually and collectively to address the negative consequences of social media use? What role do you believe tech companies should play in promoting digital well-being? Your voice matters. By sharing your perspectives and engaging in this important conversation, we can work together to create a healthier and more balanced digital world.